Mark Johnson. I'm with Artisan Restoration. Um, doing an inspection on a um, on an old barn that's actually a reproduction of, of an existing structure that was built on the Oliver Kelly farm over by um, Elk River for the State Historical Society. This is this, um, this site is run by the um, State Historical Society, and it's pretty cool building. I guess the only two original timbers in here are the 10 by 10 cross beams in the center of the building. Um, everything else in here has been replaced. Um, some of these floorboards look original though. Um, they're, they're pretty, pretty worn. Um, so, um, yeah, this one, this one here has all these little pock marks in here, are from guys standing around leaning on their pitchforks between uh, loads of hay. Um, over here, um, well, wait a minute, the scope of work. We've got to, uh, got to do a little epoxy work on that timber there. And I've got to replace one of the four by four door posts. Uh, that one, I believe, is the one. The windowsill up there leaks like a sieve. Uh, needs to be redone. And that cross beam has got a little rot on top of it. We're going to do epoxy repairs on it. And a couple of the knee braces. I don't think this is one. No. A couple of the knee braces have gotten loose uh, over time, and um, that one over there is loose, I believe. And what we got to do to fix it is put a shim in the end of the uh, mortise and tenon joint, and that'll take care of it. Down in the basement, uh, just get a heavy duty block foundation or something and what they did was they um, put rocks on it that <clears throat> looked like they're dry stacked um, by that I mean um, mortarless it's real popular these days and um, in a lot of masonry work it's done that way but um, I don't see how in the world a person could ever pile up rocks like that and expect them to stay in one place unless they were squared up and looked like blocks of, of stone. But anyway, uh, they got a couple areas that need to be um, fixed, shall we say. So anyway, I'm really looking forward to this. This is the first time I've had um, the opportunity opportunity to work on a uh, state historic uh, site like this and uh, um, I hit it off really good with the with the site manager and uh, maybe he'll call me to uh, do work on the on the house over there which they have let go and not done any maintenance on it for over 10 years so anyway Thanks for watching. We'll uh, see you on the next job.